Hey guys, my name is Bella and today's video is about how to create illusion for you guys out there, okay? As promised, this is the E part two of my illusions for women. Um, this one is gonna talk about guys. Guys, believe it or not, you have also five different shapes just like women do. You have the trapezoid, which is pretty much the equivalent to hourglass, and you have the rectangle, you have the triangle, you have the apple shape and you have the inverted triangle okay guys let's discuss this the trapezoid let's put it out of the way for now trapezoid is when you have your upper body and you have lower body so anything you're gonna put on it looks great again try to avoid wearing too tight of clothes it doesn't it's not a good look on anybody even guys okay um don't wear too tight and don't wear too big basically that's that's it for you you could wear colors, um, you could wear patterns, you could wear whatever you wanted. However, just keep it a little bit lower because you don't want to draw attention out of your perfection body, right? Because you worked out so hard. Usually trapezoid men are the ones that worked out a lot. They worked out upper body and they worked out lower body. They have both. So as long as you already have that balance, because this is what the illusion is all about. We're creating illusions to create balance. As long as you have the balance, you don't have to worry about it. Now, let's talk about the inverted triangle, the upside down triangle. The guys that do have that are those typical guys that go to the gym. Let's discuss the illusion. For now, please, please, please don't wear skinny jeans. That is just not gonna do you any good. All right, so try to stay away from skinny jeans, maybe like a little boot cut jeans, something like that. Try to um, wear a little simpler clothes at the top so you don't make your shoulders and your upper body look even bigger because that way you're actually highlighting the fact that your your legs are skinnier okay so you want to try to create this little balance okay, don't wear too long uh, too long of pants or too long of sleeves it makes you look a little bit out of proportions as well and this goes for all the body shapes as you can see in this picture he's very smart he's wearing boot cut pants because they're dark pants and a very simple t-shirt to make him look balanced in this picture he's wearing patterns and pockets and at the top very simple shirt that is black in this picture he's wearing pockets in his pants gray pants with a, a belt to attract attention to his waist in this picture he's wearing something very simple which is basic khaki pants with a bunch of pockets so they make him look thicker at the bottom and black uh, uh, jacket at the top with a shirt that's black to make him look very very balanced next shape circular or apple shape it's up to you however you want to call it that's the midsection that is getting in the way guys as you already know from my other videos i'm also pregnant so this is a very very good example for you like i'm wearing a shirt that is a little bit baggy and on top of it i'm wearing a skinny type of vest but i'm not closing it all the way so this guy over here is dressed very smart he's bringing attention to his suit jacket because it has all the patterns and he dressed all dark underneath so people the first thing that they look at is the jacket the glasses the sleek hair that is very very well dressed over there in this picture in these pictures this guy's this guy comes off very sleek as well he's playing with height with his pants in the first picture which is really nice and then suits suits in the middle and then dark colors with a little accent colored shoes a little tied uh, shirt at the waist that is very very stylish and the hat i love the hat you guys it's very cool i like this picture because it shows you the difference if you wear a hoodie with pockets people cannot tell where the dimension is coming from is it the pockets is it the belly what is going on in comparison to the second shirt which shows all the details there's no dimension there's no pockets nothing to hide nothing so basically you are who you are and i love this picture right here because it's very sleek and very simple this guy is wearing all jeans and his hair is very well done and then look at the shoes the shoes is everything the white shoes matching with the white top and it brings attention to those places it brings attention to your style instead of the weight this guy in this picture is dressed 
really really smart as well he's playing with color blocks as you can tell the blocks of black are in the bottom they're hiding the belly he's wearing black pants he's got a lot of style a lot of sleekness very very chic i love it so yeah if you guys like color block you you could play with that so that being said if your waist is the one that you're trying to cover your upper body is okay so so if you're heavier at the top and the bottom as well try to get something that is actually your size meaning it's not big and it's not tight quick reminder guys i'm making these videos as i'm pregnant because i have not yet started making videos to um, show you guys all the workouts and everything so again my husband will be joining this channel so please stick around he also has got a lot of advice to give you whether it's in workout whether it's in creating illusions in body types and all this stuff that would be amazing i can't wait for him to join the channel he's been super busy i'm the only one right now that has the time to do it because i'm pregnant and i'm at home but we will be making the time as soon as my channel takes off a little bit and gets a little bit more subscribers um, so I really do appreciate the help and the subscriptions. So, thank you. If you're an apple body shape or circular body shape, you might want to actually work on other things. Make sure that your hair is sleek, that you look clean, that you have nice shoes on, nice suit, nice clothing. Okay. You don't want to look sloppy and like everything sloppy because luckily for you guys, most women don't really care about body shapes of guys out there anyway. They care about the sleekness of every guy and how they treat them more than anything. Next body shape is the rectangle. Guys, I have seen so many rectangle body shapes in my life when it comes to guys because most guys are actually on the skinnier side, especially when they're on the younger, uh, like in the younger age between, I would say like, I don't know, 14 all the way to 24, 25, where they start gaining a little bit of weight here and there. There's all like more like slim from the top to the bottom, which I think is very cute, very attractive actually. For me, I think that type of shape is more attractive than if you have imbalanced, meaning if you did it on purpose. Like if you went to the gym and you trained just upper body and now you look like you don't have a lower body, you still have to train a lot on the, uh, to train a lot on your lower body, but also create more illusion. Now for the guys that do have a rectangular shape, if you're going to start training, you have to keep that in mind so you start training both at the same time, okay? But for you, in order to look nice, to look like you have a little bit more weight on, you don't want to, you want to avoid completely skinny, skinny clothing. You want fitted clothing that is like right fit for you. Uh, you don't want like long pants, long sleeve, none of that. As you guys can see in this picture, the first picture the guy's wearing long clothes the second two they're wearing fitted clothes with the one in the middle created um dimension with colors and scarf and a jeans jacket the se the second one looks clean and very very well put together he created dimension with patterns very nice suit this one I picked for the first guy and the last guy. They both have really nice suits, really nice colors, really nice dimensions, really nice style, and with the perfect amount of sleekness. In this picture, the first guy has so much style, so much dimensions, accessories, beautifully put together. The middle one, yes, that's way too much of a skinny jeans. The t-shirt is making him look even skinnier because it's slightly baggy, so nope. The next one has really, really nice style. V-neck on top of the shirt gives him dimension, the color, the fit of the pants, and the nice shoes put together. Very, very stylish. Next body shape is the triangle. Guys, again, we have that in the email section as well. We have all these body shapes as well. Uh, you can work on the illusion on your body so you can feel your best, feel the most confident. For guys that have a triangular shape, you want to work on making sure that your upper body looks wider. You want to wear vests or or like suit jackets or whatever jackets that you're wearing. You want to make sure they have a little padding in there, uh, something that's going to give you a little bit more chest, right? You want to wear lighter colors at the top, a little bit more darker colors at the bottom in order to create this illusion that you have similar portions at the top and the bottom, okay? so. Uh, you want to make sure that your, your pants are a little darker color and they are tapered at the bottom, not too big because you don't want to make them make you look even bigger. 
unless also you know like if you're playing with height all right if you're playing with height if you're like if you want to look taller or shorter and stuff like that i will have to make another video completely for this specific uh subject itself because this is literally just to create illusions uh for body shapes uh but it's not for height and stuff like that all right as you can see guys in this picture the first two guys played with sleekness and patterns and they added like uh, the second guy added beautiful accessories even though you would think oh wow it's a weird outfit but it's nice he basically did it the smart way he attracted the attention to his style and his sleekness and not so much about his weight okay the last guy i like the image because he added the shoulder pads and I created the illusions that he had an upper body. In this picture, the first guy to the left played with um, t-shirts that have an um, image on them, jeans with a wash, so he created dimension, and style, and accessories. Same for the second guy, same for the third guy. All have accessories and a lot of sleekness. Guys, that's the point. In this picture, these guys have all in common the shoulder pads. They made themselves look amazing with style and very, very nice suits. Very, very smart. That's it, guys, about the body shapes. Thank you so much for watching. It's been a pleasure to make these videos, and I really hope you enjoy them. Bye!